need shine eyes, please like the video, share the video, and subscribe. And also ring that bell notification. So, in this brand new store that I still am, I'm gonna show you how you're gonna make config. All you have is to follow this video to the letter, and, uh, I'm gonna show you, uh, everything step by step, okay? So, yeah, basically, first of all, what you need is, uh, you wanna download this, you wanna open a new puzzle, and you're gonna download Burp Suit Community Edition, or you can grab the Popshare Edition as well. So, I've already downloaded that. Uh, and then what you wanna do, you wanna open in terminal. So I'm assuming you have Windows 11, but if not, if you have, say, if you have like Windows 10, alright, so say if you have Windows 10, then you wanna write CMD, okay, you wanna open this, and then you wanna write IP config, okay, IP config, alright, and you wanna grab your IP4 address, okay, alright. Okay, and lastly guys, so what you need is a mobile phone, whether it's uh, Android or iPhone, iOS device, okay, it doesn't really matter, alright? So you can do this, you can do this pretty much on any uh, mobile phone, on any smartphone, alright? So yeah, and make sure that you are on the same network. Okay, so without any further ado, uh, I've already downloaded this and installed it, okay, so I'm gonna launch this thing. Alright, so yeah, and uh, even if you own Windows 11, just right click, open in terminal, and just write the same thing. Uh, IP config, press enter, and note down your, uh, IP4 address, okay? Alright, so basically we, we'll have to create a connection. So I'm gonna turn off capturing right here. Then after turning off capturing, you wanna go to proxy. Okay, and then you wanna click on proxy settings. This will open in a brand new window. You wanna turn this off. Now click add. And once you bring this down, you're gonna see your IP4 address, okay? And then you wanna bind it to a port 8080. Okay, so you wanna hit okay. And then just close out of this. Alright. Alright, so now what I'm gonna do is right here, uh, I'll be connecting to the, I'm gonna show you full step by step. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go to settings. I'm just gonna click on this and I'm gonna configure to proxy, click manual. So right here, I'm gonna write my IP4 address, which I found, which you will find yours in your, uh, when you do that thing in the command prompt. You're gonna see your IP4 address, so you're gonna write it down and you're gonna Enter this port, the same port as you put in the burp suit. Okay? And then I'm gonna hit the save button. Alright, now I'm gonna open this thing. My, uh, browser. You can open Google Chrome browser, Firefox, whatever. Then all, all you wanna do is write this HTTP, this, the column, and then double forward slash burp, and then click go. So as soon as you hit go, now, uh, if you make this a little bigger at the top right hand side, you're gonna see CA certificate. All you gotta do is to just tap on this CA certificate. Just tap and you're gonna see this. Then just click allow. Now it's gonna say profile downloaded. Just close that and go back to, now I'm gonna, I'm gonna disable this, turn off. Okay, then. After you, uh, go back to the settings, you go back to the settings, you're gonna notice right here, profile downloaded, just tap on it, and cut install right here, it's gonna prompt you for your, um, your passcode, whatever passcode that you have, so just install, cut install once again, install right here, okay? So, the post trigger CA, the certificate has been installed, but we are not done yet, so, one last thing, you wanna go to about, and then scroll down to certificate trust settings, and you're gonna see the post trigger CA. So this is, you, you have to enable this, click on this, and hit continue. Okay? Now I'm gonna close out of this. Okay, let's go. Alright? So all I gotta do is to wait for the app to load, then I'm gonna click, uh, this, I'm gonna click sign in, and right here I'm gonna, just fake this, uh, thing, okay? I'm gonna put a real email address, but I'm gonna input, uh, incorrect password, okay? And I'm not gonna click the... 
What the? Okay, yeah, I'm not gonna click sign in right here, but instead I'm gonna go back to my settings. I'm gonna go back there, and then I'm gonna go back to configure proxy manual, and I'm gonna input that um IP4 address once again, then double ATs, okay, 8080. And as you can see right here in the burp suit, and as we can see in the uh, HTTP history, so we have to click, as you can see, HTTP history is currently empty, okay? So as soon as I, I hit save, and then I go back, okay, I switch back to the app, and I hit sign in button, oh. sign in right here. And so basically, I'm, I'll be getting, as you can see, I'll be getting links, okay? Score iOS app, okay? And now I could easily create, okay, just to replace the Google with the, this, the post, paste the headers inside the post data. Post data right here, paste it right here, I'll remove this, paste the headers, which is from host to the connection close. And then add a key check, failure, and basically just copy this, Paste it right here. Add another one. Uh, you can copy this one. Invalid login ID or password. Paste it right here. And next, you want to create a success key check. Okay. A success key will be you want to switch back to the app. Okay. And you want to log in with a real account. And then you want to go back to Burp Suit. You, you want to, you will get another. Okay. You will get another. Post you are right here, so maybe of as for example this one, okay. So you wanna highlight it as whatever grain or whatever, so that you don't lose it, and then you will be able to see the success. So you can copy the token or whatever, just uh, write the word token, or maybe in some apps there are it's something like this access token. Yes. Okay, so this is how we do config.